something I'm discovering recently is this concept. I am calling it modeling love. And uh, simply put, it's like your positive actions as a parent show your kids how to be good humans. And that's why we love dads who are doing just that in our program that we started very first on this show in season one, Good Dad Program. That's right. And our next three guests are three dads from Memphis, Tennessee, who made headlines for their nonprofit that serves in their youth community. And the magic dads are making dreams come true one book bag, barbecue, and barbershop visit at a time. Please welcome Didrick, Ford, Jason Bobo, and Marvin Boyd. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so excited to meet you guys in person. Oh, yeah, we are too. too. We are too. Diedrich, tell us why the Magic Dads organization was founded. Yeah, well, we're all cousins, and we started the organization in our in our neighborhood. There's a lot of violence and uh, drug and gang activity that traumatizes our streets and our community. Um, so we started out giving haircuts. Uh, and this event grew to the point where we wanted to offer other things like giving away the book bags and, and giving away the school supplies to help the community. I work as a teacher's assistant for special needs. So I see hand in hand every day the anxiety, the de depression, and the struggles that the kids deal with. I also have a t-shirt printing company where I do uh, what they call memorial t-shirts, RIP tees, and there are kids that are barely 18 that have collections of these shirts from their friends uh, dying and being killed on the streets. Oh my God. It's so disheartening. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, Marvin, are the kids that you serve and take care of, like, do you see that they need role models? Absolutely. I mean, and we started this group just to let them know that, hey, we're positive role models and we do what we can for you. And we just want you to, you know, don't make your life so hard. Life's already hard as it is. Don't, don't make your life so hard doing things that you shouldn't be doing. Jason, mm -hmm. what does the Magic Dads symbolize? What's the intention? Tell us about it. Okay, well, I also have a barbershop called Magic Hands. So we started out uh, small with like events in the barbershop and so for the community and so all the kids will come there. So that's how we became quote unquote the magic dads of the community. So then like our first event, we used to give haircuts and hairstyles for the girls and boys going back to school for their first day of school. So that's how we initially got into it and became. Did you groom your own beard? Cause it's I did. awesome. I actually did. Yeah. <laughs> like that is, that's Thank one you. of the best beards I've ever seen. <laughs> Thank you. I was like, you're responsible. I yeah. got to call that out. Cause I like, I'm looking and I'm yeah. loving. They always ask me what kind of oils and things I'm using in this. So. Marvin, what do you tell yourself to motivate? Oh, uh, well, that's the thing. I don't want to toot my horn or anything, but this was Go ahead my and idea. <laughs> it was my idea. Toot, toot, go. But I, I got with my cousins, and I, I, I just, we just see so much violence around. I said, hey, you know, we're good guys, and it's something we need to do. It's something we need to tackle because it, it's getting rough out there, and we just want to show the kids a positive role model. Um, all right, what's next, uh, Jason, for the Magic Dads organization? Oh, uh, well, we actually hoping that they can expand and grow and just uh, teach the kids different things and just it'd be a better uh, way of living in the community as we try. I <laughs> love this. And we are so happy that you are always giving back to the community. So I thought it was about time that you guys were on the receiving end. And we had custom Magic Dad jackets made for each of you. So um, if you don't mind, we'd love for you to wow. throw those on if you're Thank interested. You. Oh, no wow. pressure, of course. Oh, wow. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Holly, so much. I love this. I love this. I love this. Thank you. Thank and they're cool. They're Letterman jackets, yeah, you know. Yeah. Um, and that's not all. Our friends at State Bags are also providing you with 200 book bags to give oh, back to wow. the children. Wow. You wow. take Thank care you. of and mentor. Thank and you. then there's one last thing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Whoa. We wow. want to gift you with this um, 
$1,000 check just to, again, enable um, you to keep doing what you're doing. And um, I'm going to match this, so it'll be $10,000. And don't forget to go to our website at thedrewbarrymoreshow.com and see what the Magic Dads are doing. Thank you for doing what you're doing. Thank you. Building the model. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. And let's follow up. Okay, I want to know what the Magic Dads are up to. All right, thank you. Diedrich Ford, Jason Bobo, and Marvin Boyd, all the way from Memphis, Tennessee. And uh, we'll be right back.